In this video, let me show you how to write quadratic equation given the roots. For example, write the quadratic equation whose roots are 2 and 3. So in this example, I will show you two approaches in writing the quadratic equation given the roots. So now, since 2 is a root, then x is equal to 2. Since 3 is a root, then x is equal to 3. Now, dito sa dalawang equation natin, gagawin natin 0 yung right side. Okay, so dito para maging 0 yung right side, mag-add tayo ng negative 2. Lipat, kailangan malipat natin si 2 sa kabila, sa left side. And now we have x minus 2 is equal to 0. Same process yung gagawin natin dito. And now we have x minus 3 is equal to 0. Now, by multiplying these two equations, we now have x minus 2 times x minus 3 is equal to 0. So, ito na yun, no? If you look at this, since this is positive 2, negative 2 na siya rito. Since this is positive 3, negative 3 na siya rito. Then, by applying the FOIL method, we have x times x is x squared, x times negative 3, negative 3x, negative 2 times x is negative 2x, and then negative 2 times negative 3 is positive 6 equals 0. By combining similar terms, ito na yung ating quadratic equation. We have x squared, negative 3x plus negative 2x is negative 5x, and then positive 6 here equals 0. And that's it. Another way is to use the sum and the product of the roots. Take note that since the roots are 2 and 3, the sum is 5. Since the roots are 2 and 3, then their product is 6. Okay? And now, using this, kaya na natin makuha yung equation. We have x squared. Since the sum is positive here, positive 5, negative 5 na dito. Negative 5x. And then, since this is positive 6, copy lang, and that is positive 6. Equals 0. And that's how we find and write the quadratic equation given the roots. Wait for the next example because one of the root is in fraction. Another example, let's say write the quadratic equation whose roots are negative 2 and 1 half. So again, we have x equals negative 2 and then x is equal to 1 half. Now, lipat natin. Okay, so we have x plus 2 equals 0 x minus 1 half is equal to 0. Now, let's multiply this together and we will have x plus 2 times x minus 1 half equals 0. Negative 2, positive 2 na siya rito. Positive 1 half, negative 1 half na siya rito. Now, papansin natin na may fraction tayo dito. So, pwede natin mas masimplihan to, no? So, itong 2 na ito ay multiply natin dito kay x. Okay, para mawala itong 2. So, we will now have x plus 2 times 2x minus 1. Itong 2, we multiply kay x, kaya naging 2x. Okay, and then minus 1. By applying FOIL method, x times 2x is 2x squared, x times negative 1 is negative x, 2 times 2x is positive 4x, and 2 times negative 1 is negative 2 equals 0. By simplifying, combining similar terms, we have the equation 2x squared, okay? So, negative x plus 4x, positive 3x, and the negative 2 equals 0. By applying the sum and the product of the roots, we have this. So, add natin negative 2 plus 1 half, and that gives us negative 3 over 2. Okay, so negative 3 over 2. Multiply natin to get the product of the roots. We have negative 2 times 1 half is negative 1. Take note, negative 2 times 1 is negative 2 divided by 2, negative 1. Now, using the standard form of quadratic equation, we now have, you know, x squared. And then, since this is negative, positive na siya rito. Opposite lang. So, plus 3 over 2x. And then, ito copy lang. We have negative 1 equals 0. To simplify this further, Notice that the denominator is 2. So, by multiplying, you know, the whole equation by this, no, by this denominator na 2, masi simplify natin. Or technically, kung uh, two parts, or kung ilang parts ng uh, equation natin ay may denominator, just simplify the LCD. But in this case, that LCD would be 2. 
So, by multiplying the whole equation by 2, 2 times x squared, 2x squared, 2 times 3 over 2x, we have positive 3x. And then 2 times negative 1, we have negative 2. Then 2 times 0 is equal to 0. And that's it. Same answer. Different methods, same answer. And that's it. I hope that you learned the process of writing quadratic equation given the roots. Thank you for watching.